Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights What's going on Summer Love and Family? It's JP here and this is like the first RV repair video probably that yeah, that I've made. Um, so, I don't know what's worse. The front windshield of an RV or the front windshield of a Jeep. Because when we were driving, when I was driving home from um, our in-laws with the RV, we got a rock chip. So, just like the Jeep. I've already had two rock chips on the front windshield of a Jeep and now we've already had one on the RV. The windshields, if everybody, everybody knows, they're so flat. So rocks really don't bounce off. But uh, rather than go through insurance, I decided to pick up this little uh, windshield repair kit because it is still a little rock chip. So it's the um, professional um, repair kit that fills it with that special stuff. Um, and the other issue is that tomorrow I have to drop it off for an inspection and it's not gonna pass probably with that uh, chip in the glass. So this kit says it's 20 minutes to repair. You don't need any tools, everything's included. I got it off of Amazon, I think it was like $9.99 and then uh, two day prime shipping. So um, yeah, let's open it up, read the instructions and um, let's do this. Oh, one other thing, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe down below and hit that bell to get notifications. All right, so now let's really do this. All right, so that's the windshield repair kit. There's all the contents right here. And then here are the instructions. All right, so I'm not gonna read through them. I'll try and go through them uh, step by step as I'm actually repairing the windshield crack and we'll see how it goes. All right. So, it's kind of hard to see, but right there, that's the little crack. So, the little chip. So we're gonna fix that. First step, we gotta clean the area. Won't stop for traffic lights. And I, I really wanna know, really wanna know. If I... All right, first step, clean it. Pretty simple. All right, so far so good. All right, next step, you gotta put this adhesive ring on and you have to have this tab point up, according to the directions. And then you gotta peel off the outside um, adhesive ring, which is the red. And you got to put this included plastic, which is uh, allows for the adhesive to go in. You got to put that in there. Make sure it's pointing up, and it lines up with your hole. And press that into place. All right, so far so good. All right, so next step, you gotta fill it with the resin. And that's where this comes in handy. And it's cold. Alright, right, so 
now we gotta place this plunger in and then pull it all the way up. They said this is the vacuum position and we gotta let it sit in there for 10 minutes. All right, so it's uh, two minutes to three. See you in 10 minutes. If I let figure out where the road goes. All right, so we got about eight more minutes before this thing fully cures. But in the kit, um, they actually gave you another uh, one of these rings. Um, and some other of these films that you have to use and the resin is in a reusable container so you can definitely you can fix more than obviously one rock chip so um, for 10 bucks you can fix two rock chips and not have to go through the whole insurance hassle um, to have them come out here so that's definitely uh, positive um, I would definitely keep this probably I'm probably gonna keep a kit here in the RV and I'm probably gonna keep a kit in the shed for the Jeep um, just in case I get another rock chip on that and just save on the hassle as long as it works out hopefully this works <laughs> because I don't know so all right uh, I'll see you in eight minutes there's no way I can yap about anything for another eight minutes all right I got my little buddy Odin here to help me but once that's done after 10 minutes you got to pop this off let some air in it and then there's this little notch. You gotta plunge it down to that little notch to get air into it. And then you gotta let it sit another 10 minutes. So, reseal it, rotate, plunge air, and lock it. And now they said let that sit for another 10 minutes. All right, what do you think? Yeah, all right, we'll be back. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Hey, Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high. Alright, last step. Now I'll pull everything off. This has to get peeled off. Now you gotta peel this guy off. So far, it looks pretty good. Just wipe off some excess resin. And then you gotta use the curing film, which is this film. And it says to put one more dot of resin right in the center. And then this goes right on top. And it was sunny before. But it says smooth out the bubbles. And then this has got to sit for now 15 minutes in direct sunlight or an hour in hazy. And of course the sun's behind clouds now, so I think I'm in for an hour. All right, I'll see you in an hour or maybe 30 minutes. Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Alright, so we just gotta peel this off and just scrape the residue
well, it looks better than it did, but it's not perfect. So let's see if you can if I can show you what it looks like, but you can still see a little bit. So I don't know if you can see it. That was the spot right there. And it's kind of not perfect. It's better than it was. So, I guess I could take it. See, it should pass inspection like that. All right, let's go inside and have a little recap. All right, what's going on everybody? That was it for my uh, first ever windshield resin repair. I don't think it's great. I don't think it's horrible. Uh, it should, be, should do the trick to get it past inspection. Um, so I'll link the Amazon link down below where I purchased this. Again, it was like nine bucks. You can use it to fill two cracks. Um, maybe if another crack happens, I'll try another brand, see if that one works better. Maybe a little more expensive brand, but. Uh, all right, so I will let you guys know if I pass inspection or not. All right, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. Subscribe down below and hit that bell for more notifications. Thanks for watching my first RV repair video. Stay tuned for more. And you can also watch my Jeep videos. Got a bunch of those. All right, see you on the next one. Have a great day. Trust in our wings to fly. Sometimes we're crashing down, but we get up and start from the ground.